right there, 60.5 gigabytes, 1,505 1, files. Some of these files are upwards of 20 gigabytes each, while others are just a few MBs. Um, those super large ones, I cannot save them in PNG format because I get an error telling me not enough memory. That is a little absurd, but alright. Let's play along not enough memory. So I removed everything I possibly can for the data collection <coughs> data collection. However, I cannot remove um, the customer experience improve uh, customer experience improvement program, which I opted out of. So it should not be running on my computer at all when you install your windows or you update it asks you to check a little box to opt in well when you do not opt into this they run it anyways and removing the registry keys for this since there's no files in windows for it removing the registry keys causes nothing but a black screen so you're screwed and yeah i ha i don't have enough memory 32 gigabytes, but I built this computer, <laughs> okay, so don't expect to be buying a computer with 32 gigabytes of RAM. However, you can upgrade yours if your motherboard is capable, but I don't recommend <coughs> trying to use your own computer to make you any money because Microsoft and NVIDIA will use you as a victim. They're saving billions by not hiring a graphics design department every time they release a product of somebody else's they're getting paid for it and every sale they're getting royalties and the people behind the work don't, do not see one cent of it and nobody cares but we have laws to protect us they have the same laws they get to use them and nobody says you cannot steal from your customers why? Is our nation really that corrupt that we can't allow people to start their own company? I started design as a way to make extra money so I can better support my child. That's why I put so much into building this computer. That's why I have Photoshop. That's why I have nearly 90,000 files. That's why you see so many new designs constantly popping up, new filters popping up. Real D game textures popping up. Somebody's getting paid for it, not the people that's actually making it, and nobody cares to step up and say, no, 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 you gotta end this. <clears throat> By law, <clears throat> if I could get one attorney to take my case, they could settle each file is one infringement. 90,000 files, no less than $30,000 times 90,000. But all I really want is to be paid. I don't want to be rich. I want to be considered an employee. Since you're using my product to get richer and richer and richer, why shouldn't I even get one cent per file? Ten cent. How about ten dollars? Every time I make a file, you pay me ten dollars. You own everything. And the rest is all profit, but I don't get anything. Why is this? As you see, 60 gigabytes, 60.5 gigabytes. There's my BitLocker jobs. Okay, that's a 116 gigabyte drive right there <coughs> with 
43.4 gigabytes left on it. When you open it, this top folder, one more folder, contains web cache files proving that they've been caching everything I create. Right. You want a 72.7 gigabytes of use space on the drive, plus the 60.5, so I've got a ton of files that I created. Oh, why is this a lot of focus now? There we go. 201 files, they're web cache. Every time I open one and unlock one of these drives, every file on it is in the web cache. I cannot stop them. I have no internet connection. Every time I remove one of their products, more pop up. This is the folder I'm currently working on. Two thousand eight hundred and forty files at fifteen gigabytes. All right, amazing, right? When I've got when I have thirty three thousand files in this folder alone. Fourteen point nine gigabytes for thirty-three thousand files. As you can see, I have all of my files. I have proof that they're stealing from me, and nobody will help me. Why? 